Hi, I am Dr. Vaibhav Deraje. I am a consultant craniofacial and plastic surgeon, Bangalore. Positional plagiocephaly or sometimes it is called as deformational plagiocephaly is where there is an abnormal shaped skull just because of the position of the child in the first few months. Now you might have noticed at your home that the grandmothers insist upon massaging the head to improve the shape of the head. Now all this is, was traditionally thought of as problems happening because of the position of the child when the child is sleeping. Now when this is significant enough, this is when we call it as positional plagiocephaly or deformational plagiocephaly. I would just like to show uh, an image where this is a, a skull model where you can see that one side on the back of the skull is bossing whereas the other side is flat. That is probably due to the child being lying down on one side more than the other. Now this needs to be differentiated from craniosynostosis where the same kind of deformity can happen because of the fusion of these sutures. Now that is a challenge and that needs to be diagnosed pretty early whether the child has craniosynostosis or whether the child has positional plagiocephaly. So we usually get an x-ray done just to check if all the sutures are intact and if all the sutures are patent then it is most probably positional plagiocephaly. Now how this is treated? Now positional plagiocephaly can be mild, it can be moderate, it can be severe. Mild and moderate plagiocephaly doesn't require any treatment. As the child grows, as the child decreases its bedtime and you increase tummy time in the child, as the child sits up, all these mild to moderate plagiocephaly gets corrected by itself. But sometimes in very severe positional plagiocephaly, some children might require helmet therapy. Now this helmet therapy is provided by our orthotists and that is usually where a helmet is worn for a period of about three to six months time to improve the shape of the skull.